that I just received, and it's might one might that might be super important or impactful for you, and that is, are there any essential oils that can help me with my headaches? And the answer is a giant yes. <laughs> um, and the probably the oil that is most known for headaches is peppermint oil. And you would want to use this topically, not internally, not, um, it, I mean, it would have some impact if you were smelling it, but it's, it topically would be the best thing for a headache. If you have the ability to buy some additional, like peppermint is one of the, is one of those foundational oils. So probably anybody who has some essential oils has peppermint and that's the beauty. You can use it. It works really well for headaches and you'd put it like on the area of your headache. If it's, uh, you know, if it's in the front or if it's in the back, you know, some people get it like clenching in the back of the neck or, or the back of the, the head or down the neck, you can use it. Um, you can get it even in a roller ball that makes it even easier. Like this is what a roller ball looks like. And, um, oh, that's so funny. I literally just pulled out the oil I wanted to talk about. I just grabbed one. Um, <laughs> that's so funny. That's, thank you. Um, so this is a roller ball and this is a blend. This was gonna be my next thing anyway for headaches. This is my go-to. This is what turned my significant other into a believer in essential oils because he was the guy who carried that huge bottle of Advil or Tylenol in his car. Oh my God, he goes now, oh my God, my poor liver. But uh, when I had him try this blend, when you hear a name like past tense, it means a, it's a blend of several oils. And um, past tense has peppermint in it. It has wintergreen for cooling. It has lavender for calming. Um, it has rosemary leaf that just gives us a little sharper brain when we're in the midst of all of this. And just here, I'll show you. You just, if I had a frontal headache, roll it on here. I could put it on down the, it's also great for neck tension or, you know, behind here. You can smell it, I can, and it'll perk you up because that's one of the things that peppermint does. And I just love this blend. And one of the things to remember with headaches is what's causing it, right? Because we're not just like trying to take an aspirin to get rid of it. If it's sinus related, you probably want to do something that opens up the airways like eucalyptus. If it's super stress related, something like lavender might just calm you down and do it. But that's why I love this blend because it has all of them in it and you don't always have to think about it. So that's my take on headaches and essential